welcome. We're so excited. Councillor Flores and I are here today. A shout out to our pickleballers over here. Aren't you excited? Yes. Thank you so much for attending our, our groundbreaking ceremony. Um, my name is Cassandra Gandara, Mayor Pro Tem for the City of Las Cruces. Can you hear me okay? Yes, better, right? Yeah. Um, we're here today, as you know, very exciting, one of our Geobond product projects, right? The East Mesa Public Recreational Complex. Special thanks to our, our voters for voting um, for this measure. Um, as you may or may not know, quality of life is very important to the City Council and Mayor Mahigashima. And this is just one more addition um, that will have a, a multi-recreational um, um, activities here and we're, we're really excited about that. Um, as you know, our geo bond projects um, were about $35.75 million, had several projects and those projects include um, things like our new fire station three, which was badly needed in, in that area, in Councilor Bencomo's area, our animal services center and the expansion of that. Um, our animals are, are all very important to us as well. Our recreational trails that included um, updates. Isn't this difficult to do as you're trying to read off in this 30 degree, 30 uh, mile per hour winds? Our parks and sports fields facilities that included improvements to the pickleball park, um, specifically of Apodaca Park and the renovation of our Unidad Park. Um, and the new East Mesa Recreational Center, which Councilor Flores will be giving more specifics to in just a bit. Now we have a potential to impact our community yet again with a 2022 geo bond um, coming up and, and we will start to have public meetings, very specific and please look to our website for those public uh, meetings. We'd love to hear from you and we could start with those public meetings as early as next month. And with that, I'd like to introduce my friend and colleague, Councillor Flores. Thank you, Mayor Pro Tem Gandara. And yes, I would like to read my notes too. So the importance of this project is seeing our tax dollars at work for the betterment of our community by creating recreational spaces and providing arenas that draw tournaments and visitors to Las Cruces. It's highlights. It's a 10 acre park. We have two baseball fields. We have eight pickleball courts, woo hoo! Um, we have supporting amenities. The estimated cost is one, let me see my, $7.87 million. And um, some of that, most of that will come from the GO Bond and our ARPA funds are also going to this. It's not considered, an, it's not within the anti-donation clause because it's federal monies, not state monies. The contractors, and I would like to thank, first of all, I'd like to thank our fantastic staff most of them are here today. Um, our mayor, excuse me, city, assistant city manager, Ikani uh, Tamopeo, the, the tall one over there. Uh, next to him, I believe, is our parks and rec director, Sonia Delgado. Um, yay. Um, let me see. I'm trying to point out, oh. Our other assistant city manager, it took two of them to make up for one city manager who wasn't here. <laughs> Sorry, Ipo. Um, Eric uh, Enriquez. Uh, our deputy um, uh, public works director, Tony Trevino. Our director for public works, David Cedillo. And let me see, go down the and then our communications director, Mandy Gus, and then our communications person over here, Adrian Guzman. Thank you. And so, and then, oh, and then we have one of our consultants here, uh, George Radnovich from Side Southwest. I'd also, uh, also like to acknowledge um, the, um, the contractors. The general contractor is Morrow Enterprises. Morrow Enterprises, there you are. 
thank you for being here. Get this work done really fast. No piddling around, no more increasing costs because of COVID. And then it's like, wait a minute, wait a minute. So um, Architects Wilson and Co uh, and Company, Wilson, hello, thank you for being here. Uh, program management is ECM International. Hello, hello, and thank you all very, very much. And uh, let's hope that this gets done sooner than later. And thank you all very much for being here today. Mandy. Thanks so much again. Thank you, city staff. Um, I know I see many of you out there. Um, thanks again. I mean, as you can tell, it really takes all of us to make something like this happen. And this is an exciting, exciting um, opportunity for all of us. And so with that, I'll turn it over to Mandy. I think we're ready to do groundbreaking, I think, <laughs> or something. <laughs> and Eric, Sonia, and David, can I get you up here with a shovel as well? All right. We got our shovels ready. And then we're gonna, on the count of three, lift up and dump over and try not to get dirt on everyone. Ready? And one, two, three. 